Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel and for today's episode, I'll be showing to you how we perform plant extraction. So, what is plant extraction? So according to Google, plant extraction is the process that aims to extract certain components present in the plants. So basically, plant extraction can be done in different processes. You can either boil the plant, so you can get the water-soluble compounds present in the plants. Also, you can do alcohol extraction using different alcohols like uh, methanol or ethanol. So you can get all alcohol-soluble compounds. So hello guys, this is a rotary evaporator and we will be using this today for our plant extraction. So how do you set up the rotary evaporator and how do you load your samples? So all you need are this stuff. First is your plant extract macerated in a solvent. So we put the plant material which is the leaves of Corcoris auditorius. In the Filipino, it is called saluyot. So we soak the saluyot leaves in a solvent for three days. Then, after three days, we filtered it to remove the the plant material or the leaves, leaving us this solution. So the solution is composed of the solvent plus all the compounds soluble on this solvent so we'll be transferring this in a round flask so we can load it there then this is an amber vial which will be the container of our plant extract or the final product so first we will be transferring this solution in this round flask.
then the next step is to turn on the heating bath on then set it in about 40 I guess and then turn on the rota evaporator so we'll be putting this round flask here and we will lock it using this one so it will not fall off so the next step is turn on the vacuum then turn on the irritation so when you see it, it is already bubbling meaning the process has already started so guys by the time that the solvent has already settled if it is not bubbling you can now lower it to be heating back then wait for it to evaporate so the solvent contained in this round flask will evaporate here then we'll go here in this part the solvent that we use will be condensed because we have a running water here it will condense and all the solvent will be collected here so guys as you can see the process has already started the solvent is already evaporating and see that those droplets it means that the solvent that evaporated is already condensing turning it into the its liquid form and it will be collected here that's pretty cool see that tablet so in this machine you can see the rpm or the rotation per minute of this round flask and the temperature of the the vapor so once it is already looking like this you can now stop the rotary evaporator Stop the rotation, raise the flask, turn off, and then turn off the heating bath. Now, open the vacuum. Then close the vacuum. Then we can now remove this. We have now our plant extract. So we're going to spray it. After transferring, we'll be putting this in the fume hood for further evaporation of the solvent so it will leave us a very sticky plant extract and we will be running it in HPLC and LCMS MS
Parker Salutorious Lips in water. So guys, after the function, we transfer the mixture in a centrifuge tube. Then we fold it in the centrifuge at 10,000 RPM. So, after collecting the plant extract or the supernatant after the centrifuge, we put it in a centrifuge tube, then put this in the negative 80 degree freezer to freeze the plant extract. After freezing like about a day, After freezing it, we load it in a freeze dryer. Okay guys, thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also, click the notification bell so every time I upload a new video, you will be notified. Thank you. Bye.